Alright, so, I always get asked, how do I keep such a high FPS, so, let's just go over exactly what you guys need to do to, uh, to get high FPS like me. So, right now I'm running a Windows, or sorry, a uh, user PC benchmark right here with a software that will give my PC a score. So, first I'm just going to look at that to make sure everything's working, but first what you guys should do is right click on the desktop and you'll either see AMD or NVIDIA. If you don't see either of these... You want to go over here, and this is the AMD one, so you search what processor you, or GPU you have, and then this is the NVIDIA's. They're both set up the same. Do that, see what comes up. Make sure to actually have a drive, and if you're unsure if your drives are up to date, they're both pretty much the same. You can go over to your GeForce Experience, or you can go over to your AMD, and then run a quick check for system updates. And then if there is an update, update it. You should always try to keep the latest version, because they work together with games like Fortnite, PUBG, uh, Call of Duty, all that, to uh, get you the best frames you possibly can for your device. <clears throat> now... After this, I will show you exactly what you're going to do in-game. I just want to show you this just so that way you can see what part of your computer is going slow, if any. Because sometimes it's actual mechanical part and not your GPU or how you have it set up exactly. Sometimes if your hard drive is at an overload, it can actually stutter your frames, which is weird, but has happened to me several times when I've been downloading something in the background and I was wondering why my computer was running so slow. So we can go over here and see my computer. <clears throat> so high CPU usage, which I was expecting. Normally the score is closer to 69. Uh, yeah, right here my processor was being used big time, my graphics card being pretty normal. Uh, my... <clears throat> SSD here didn't score anywhere near as good as my other one. And then my hard drive currently in use doing something. So you can look at this and just get a general idea. Next, what you want to do to make sure that it's set up correctly before you go on Fortnite. You can now close this. Right click, go down to display settings. You're going to click advanced display settings. Go to display settings and then list. And it will show every single thing that you can get your computer to do i like uh 19 by 20 by 1080 at 144 hertz myself but you can select any one of these that are shown for you um and then you just click ok accept it and then it will be set up next in fortnite we'll open it up <coughs> check her out <sighs> Could take a little while. For some reason, my webcam didn't come on, so I wonder if I even have it plugged in. Alright, anyways, gonna go into the Battle Royale, and now this one is vital for high FPS. I've heard people say, oh, you don't need to do this, but trust me, you need to do this. And it is very, very easy. All you're gonna do, go over to your settings, and I want you to set this to unlimited. Not 144 frames, if you're using 144 frames monitor, I can probably show you right now. So right now we're sitting at 300 and... 390, 340. If I turn that on, it's just going to be sitting at max what you set. Half the time it won't even stay at this, so set it to unlimited. Set that to unlimited, make sure to have your thing set up for your screen, and set it full screen. Not windowed, full screen. You want VSync off. You never want to keep this on. You keep that off, and now you're going to be getting the highest FPS if you followed all those steps. So anytime someone asks me this, if you feel like sharing this with them, greatly appreciated.